guys, this is Bubbub here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to install Windows 8 in VMware or VirtualBox. Now, this isn't just any Windows 8, this is Windows 8 Beta. I forget what build it is. So, we're going to be doing this in VMware Fusion, so yeah, it's going to be pretty cool. So first you want to go to Plus and then New. Then you want to click Continue. Now, usually... You want, if it's not there, you want to click Use Another Disk Image, find the one you have, download it, link to the description, and then open it. And now, my, VMware has a Microsoft Windows Easy install. So paste your product key in, that's also in the description. So you can name your account whatever you want, type a password if you want, and then enter the product key. Now choose Windows 2012 Standard. Now, I like to do more isolate. Jack it up. You customize settings. Name it Windows 8. Right? Now you want to boot this puppy up. Now one of the different things is it was themed all around fish. Windows 8 beta is themed all around. choose the only option which is Windows Developer Preview. Then here you just let it download. Okay guys, so it finally booted into the desktop here. That took about 10 minutes, so yeah. This is the Windows background and honestly it shouldn't even be Windows 8, it should be Windows 7.1. Because the beta is actually just like Windows 7. Except with things. So here, let's look what Windows Basic looks like, because Windows is just the area. I think Windows Basic, yep, Windows Basic is like a mix of Windows 7s and then Windows 8s current. So yeah, this is how it looks like. So now let's install Virtual VMware Virtual Box. Let's install Virtual VMware Virtual Tool. Now apparently if you do the auto, it'll auto it'll, 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 it'll automatically install it. Okay guys, so I should sound a little bit better now because I just realized I was recording with my Macintosh's in internal mic, which isn't that good. So I'm going to show you the Windows 8.8's blue screen. Now if Windows 7 had a baby with Windows 8 and they had a blue screen together, what do you think it would look like? doesn't even have blue, so what's the point of calling it a blue screen of death? Here, just find out for yourself. And there's the blue screen. Okay guys, so yeah, that's the end of this video. Make sure to drop a like, and I'll see you all later. Bye!